Hi Scorpio, it's Leslie with your February forecast. Happy Valentine's Day to everybody. What a wonderful month it is. It's, we all love it because it's love and it's candy and it's flowers and it's fun. Um, I just wanted to say to start with, I've had so many comments and questions whether I was leaving, whether Omar was taking over from me, was I retiring? No, I'm not leaving. Uh, he's not taking over from me. I'll be here. As long as you want to watch me, I'll be here. And I thank you for all your nice comments. I appreciate it very much and your views. Um, Omar has, has retired from his regular daytime job he had for 29 years. And he's working for us now full time, uh, five shifts a week. And there'll be two or three days and two or three nights. It'll, it'll mix up a little bit. But, and he's very good. He's, he's very, very, very accurate. Okay, let's see what it says for you for this month for your forecast. Home improvement techniques. You may research for house guests. You may want to change something, make it nicer. You may want to devote more time to your love life and spend more playtime with children. Uh, so it's a month for that. Um, you may be called upon to offer a lesson to someone who wants to know more about what you know and things that you do very well. And it would, it would be good for you to do that because we always refresh ourselves when we're teaching someone something that we know. It always brings some, we always learn something new. Um, the solar eclipse on the 15th and the new moon in Aquarius in, in February, it's very, very good for you. You should focus more intently on a career goal. Um, I think you feel like you want to take a break. I think right now you just want to take a break. I really do. Um, your best days are the 5th, the 15th, and the 24th. And let's see what the cards have in store for you. Remember, if you want to have a little special love reading uh, the week of, of Valentine's, uh, we're going to have a special for 15 to 20 minutes. Here's the number to call and we'd love to talk to you. We have some really, really nice psychics too. We have, um, of course, Dawn, you all know, we have a new new psychic. Her name is Lisa. She just works a little, and by appointment, she's very, very good. Um, and as I said, Omar, we have Starrell in the daytime. We have Shirley during the day. Um, Brandon, um, I can't leave anybody out here. Sue, who am I forgetting anybody? Connie is good. She works a couple of nights. And so we have we have a very nice crew here. Very nice. We're like a little family. And of course we have Sue and it's my assistant, the videographer, the bestest and the bestest. And my she does everything. Uh, she's here in the daytime. And we have Doug uh, two, two nights a week. Then we have Kathy through the week. And Brandon a little bit on Fridays. Okay. Let's see what the cards have in store for you. If you wanted to know more about them, you can go to the webpage and they each have a little bio on there or, or receive the newsletter okay well here you go someone someone's helped you um i believe someone has helped you some even if it's just with solid advice or very very um support very much support for you in something you're doing um i think you have some friends that might want you to do something with them whether it's a trip whether it's going somewhere or whether it's starting a little business uh i really do think that and your mother may be a person who's really support, supportive of you or someone who's very maternal. You are a very maternal person also. Okay, here we are. Here we are. And she, here's the star. That is the card of Aquarius. And she's, um, she doesn't have any clothes on because she doesn't have to hide anymore. And she's reached her goal. And now she's trying to know what her next goal is. And it's always important if you're about ready to reach a goal or retirement or anything that you have a new goal okay here's the sun and that's again good health these are very very nice cards together and you have the best card in the deck is the end card on um, the sun tells me you're going you may be going someplace that's sunny you may have a little trip planned um that would be great and you also if you have any any procedures anything medical that you're concerned about you it will be all right it will be better and if you have something close to you you're concerned about it will take a little time but they will be better they will heal better too i don't know why i want to say that but i feel that way here you are with your friends your friends really may want to do something with you a little trip a little outing um a business together but i, I believe you're beginning together talking to your friends very much so um here you are some of your ideas you can't seem to um, get people to go with you with them but just keep it up you have good ideas you have a good mind just keep going with it and here you have the best card in the deck as your outcome so everything is coming together for you here um scorpio very very much so so have a wonderful month bye bye